So it's a little bit windy out there, so they've decided to call off racing for the day and we're gonna go out again tomorrow and try and race tomorrow. But in the meantime, we're gonna do a little speed run just inside here, outside the yacht club. Someone's about to launch into this uh, angle of angle of uh, glory, as we're gonna call it from now on. And Elise is giving it to it. Easy to pick with the big pink wings. She had a big fall yesterday and hurt her neck, so it's pretty brave for her to get out there and have another crack. That's fast. But that when they're doing the up and down. Oi, and oh nice. 59.39. First one under a minute, Mr. Ian Gooby Jensen. That's uh, 42 seconds. I know he's gonna make it. I know he's gonna get there in 18 seconds. You're slow outreach, you're very, very slow. Yep, Haragi. Not gonna do it, but he's certainly giving it all his best. Oh, oh he's put one in. Oh, he's saving it. He is on the edge. And it's Kyle, it's definitely Kyle Stoneham, so it's, uh, he's having a good run. Oh, he loves putting his top wing in. He's sailing right on the edge. Coming into 52, it's gonna be a hot time, this. He could be taking it off the big boys, and he has easily. We've got Dylan Fletcher on the course. This is it, this is the last run. We need to get some pressure off this uh, shore, otherwise it's gonna be Kyle's. He's had enough, we realise he's gonna come. Second, third, fourth, 28, doesn't matter. He's not gonna win it. We had 12 people actually score times. In 12th place was Twiggy. In 11th place was James Ross. 10th place was Craig Bolton. In 9th place was John Heathcote. In 8th place was young Ben Smith. In 7th place was Paul Glidden. In 6th place was Dylan Fletcher. In 5th place was Hiroki Goto. In 4th place was Mr. Stewie Bithell. All right, now we got the podium, Nathan Outridge in 1 minute 1 at 69. Second place was Mr. Ian Gooby Jensen, breaking the sound barrier in under a minute at 59.39 seconds. And the winner, Mr. Kyle Stoneham in 58.96 seconds. Well done, mate. Uh, what do you think of the event? Well, cracking, considering um, it wasn't planned or anything. Um, I think that's where I did quite well by not having the preparation time. Yeah, to, uh, yeah to too go much out overthinking. There. Yeah, no time to think, so I just went out there and uh, just sent it. What was your tactics? Uh, just keep the boat underneath the rig was the main the main thing. Um, I had big foils and a stiff mast because that's all I've got. So uh, the big is the new little. Yeah, big is the new small and stiff is always the new soft. So, so we're uh, going to call you big big stiff man from now. <laughs> yeah, if you don't mind. Perfect. I've been trying to get my girlfriend to call me that for <laughs> ages. Yeah.